The death is announced of Joseph Hippolyte, better known as Evans or Daddy Goggs or Goggle, originally of Grosley, but residing at Le Clary, who passed away at Victoria Hospital on Saturday, July 22, 2017, at approximately 10.30 a.m. He was 67 years old. He leaves to mourn his wife, Helen Hippolyte of Riviermita Moshi, his son, Acting Sergeant Zachary Hippolyte of the Royal St. Lucia Police Force, granddaughter, Zachelia Hippolyte of Pebush Babono, adopted daughter, Emily Peters of La Clary Castries, godson, Peter Inglis, better known as Rabbi of Kazaba Grosele. Brothers Augustine Eritine, better known as Nixon of Kazaba Grosele. Alexander Hippolyte, better known as the Mighty Octopus of Kazaba Grosele. John Tommy, better known as D. Abert, residing in England. Sisters Helen Delphus, better known as Seye of Massad Road Grosele. Marjorie Gustav, residing in Germany. Ida Eritang, residing in the USA, Rose Hippolyte of Kazaba, Eldra Polius of Kazaba, Nephews, Andre Hippolyte, residing in Canada, Bradley Hippolyte, residing in England, Neville Crowley Eritan, better known as Lossie of Kazaba, Kalima Hippolyte of Kazaba, Kudos Hippolyte of Kazaba, Aaron Hippolyte of Kazaba, Alex Hippolyte of Kazaba. Nieces, Kalita Lloyd residing in Anguilla, Desma Hippolyte residing in Canada, Lara Gustav presently studying in Trinidad and Tobago, Yasmina Gustav de Turville presently studying in Jamaica, Shoma Gustav of Grosley, Daughter-in-law, Ruth Elastic of Beauceju, Brosele. Long-time companion, Marina Samuel of La Clary Castries. Heather Gulliman and family of La Pansy Castries. Sandra Monrose and family of Union Babano. Close friend and neighbor, Clive Minal of La Clary Castries. The Henry family of La Clary Castries many other relatives and friends too numerous to mention. The funeral service for the late Joseph Hippolyte, better known as Evans, or Daddy Goggs or Gogo, originally of Grosley but residing at La Clary, will take place on Thursday, August 3rd, 2017, at 2.30 p.m. at the St. Joseph the Worker Catholic Church in Grosley. The body will then be interred at the Grosley Cemetery.